So blink, boom, so boom, boom, and then that over there. The space bar, push it over to its second square. And that's always a stick to me. Look at that. Paste that. Stone. Over here. That's be steel, that's gold, that's diamond. So cobblestone to create that. So we take that away and put cobble. Cobble. Mm. Now as I said, it doesn't matter what order I put this in. Now, um, I had someone talk to me about the this me doing this takes away any recipes any other modder may have added in, so you can while you're doing while you're doing this add in those other recipes if you want to, but I am not going to myself. Too ca time consuming. And boom, so then we'll control save that, exit that out. We'll tell that to export. So we're done and eclipse. And I want to port it out to the hand axe mod folder. Finish. Exit off eclipse. And there it is on the files. Mm. Go ahead and close that down. And over here, this is where we want to drop all this stuff. So, all of it, copy. Yes to all. It just replaces those three files. Now, over here, I like to make my. I have to keep my mods compatible with my other ones, so I've also included this stuff in there. So, I need to get their items. Since it's the most up to date one, I also need my hand shovel. Copy, paste, and then I also want my short blade. If not, I will have a some errors pop up. Hmm, wrong folder. Now I expect two or three errors my first time through every time, just because of a typo or something like that. But it's awesome when you don't. Go back into it, and then you, after you drop those in there, you go and recompile. And this is where it will tell you if you have any errors. I expect a few. I always do. Like my first time through, and then after I fix them, I'm like, yeah, no more errors. I may not get any errors. Last time, the only time I got, the only reason I didn't get errors is because I didn't drop those other files in. I have five errors with the hand pick. Right, now let's see why. Now they're all with the, my hand pick, so they're in the item file. Alright, I always do that. Same reason I got it last time. See, because in earlier versions, not this last update, but the update directly before it, when it added in, the first beta update, and all that up to beta 1.2 you would you would type in your ID and then that you wouldn't give this whole whatever type of material it was and then he changed that later on and it gives me that error every time because I forget to add those in so stone handpick stone Gold, emerald. Even though it's actually diamond, I don't know why it's called emerald. So we'll control save. You can actually work that way in Notepad. You can do everything in Notepad, but it's better to get Eclipse. It's also free, so I would just get it. Okay, now I expect no errors because I only have five errors, and I fixed those five errors just now. 
so I expect new air. So my hands are now behind my head, and I'm behind my head, and I'm leaning back like, yeah. Yep, compiling Minecraft, start class, press any key to finish, Oop, and then we'll test game. It'll pull up a different version of Minecraft. This is not real Minecraft, as you can tell, it does not have the right symbol. World 4, these are just start worlds that I've missed in. Okay, so then you take that, and then we'll need to get some wood before we can look at it. Okay, so then we'll get us some more sticks. Go into our inventory crafting. Ooh. Like that. And. And boom. Now I think I'm gonna. I think I'm gonna run in there and. Could that be a better design for it? Or would that be better suited for a hoe? I don't know, I think the hoe will be that design, but anyways, they were with that, so we'll take that out. Ark, I need you. I need you other piece of cobblestone. And boom. So we got our actual pick, our mini pick, actual shovel, mini shovel. Actual sword, mini sword, actual axe, mini axe. Now, let me show you guys. Okay, regular axe. Bum bum ba dun. Bum ba dun. See, it works the same way. Just, in some cases, it just doesn't last as long. So, we're not done yet. We're, all, we're past the halfway point. We're at the three fourths way point. I just like to save so that way I can keep my stuff and exit out of that Minecraft. And then <clears throat> wait for this to exit out. Then we go into this. We want to grab all the files that we want. We open up this text and we type in the jar the Java's that we want. So we want hand axe wood. Hand axe stone. Hand axe steel. Hand axe gold. We want those three as well. So then we'll control save that. Go up. We'll go Rio Boof. We'll boof a buffcate. The buffskating client. Now, while it's over there doing that, I'm just gonna mess with something over here. You don't have to worry about this. This is just what I'm gonna 
upload. And then you drop it in here if you want to upload it. You have to have a GUI folder for your items file, which includes your new items in there. And then that will mess with it a second. As soon as I get to the hand shovel, it's really taking a while to obfuscate that client. And then we'll copy this from my hand shovel because it's the most update link file. We'll go into the hand axe. there, paste that in, and now when you first get this you're going to have to right click it and tell it to open with notepad. It's taking forever to investigate that client. And we're going to scroll down until we see item handpick. Keep going, short played. I don't know where my hand, no, oh, hand shovel's right there, never mind. So then we type in item dot hand axe. I'm going to copy that. Wood dot name equals wood hatchet. Because see, it goes hatchet stone dot name equals stone axe. Stone dot name equals stone Hatchet steel dot name equals steel hatchet gold just because it's right there name equals gold hatchet diamond dot name equals diamond hatchet good, that is that good, save, the rest of the case you can complete, so then we'll go up a level, over to MCP, go into our final out folder, go into Minecraft, and this is everything we want, oh. so then this will, when you unzip your folder, this will be everything that's in there for that, now, Say you made a mod for a server, which I don't know how to do. That would be where you would get it in. Okay, so now we're done in MCV. Correct, 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 correct. Yeah. Okay. Now, I'm going to copy all these. Well, actually, I'm going to copy... I'm going to copy all these... Everything, actually. Then I'm going to go up... This, this step you do not have to follow, but I'm just updating my package. I already has. Yes, I know. Yes, I know. Yes, I know. I replace everything and add those in. I don't think this comes with a short blade in it, does it? No, it doesn't. It don't require them, though. I just realized that. So if you get the whole package, it comes with the short blade too. So that's something. Package. Up. Send to... Compress it folder. Handles package v 1.3. Although I did say version 1.2 would include it. No, 1.3 includes it. I'm sorry. Okay. Now you want to do the same thing over here with your mod. You'll want to send it to. You just compress it folder that's already on your computer. You don't have to install anything to be able to do that. Just boom. And for some reason, it never takes my point. So, I always have to add that in. 